A disagreement between two friends would later cost one his life. Lambert was reportedly stabbed multiple times by the suspect, Victor, popularly known as Yolo. The deceased was pronounced dead upon arrival at the Ipafras Hospital. Occupant of this building said they heard the two friends exchanging words, but never expected it to end in this tragic manner. These visible blood stains paint a picture of severity of the stabbing. Close sources revealed that the deceased was stabbed in the armpit and raped. The suspect is said to have left the scene immediately after causing the harm. Even though nothing can be done to bring back our brother, arresting and prosecuting the perpetrator will assuage our pain. We have suffered a big loss. Assembly member for Kronum Kwapra, Payos Echampo, said residents are assisting the police to arrest the suspect. Wherever the suspect is, I believe that the police will hunt for him and arrest him. And once he's arrested, definitely we will hear more uh, from, from the police. The suspect do not live around Kwapra here. He stays around Bokrum and so definitely the police, once they are aware of his uh, hideouts, they will definitely go around and search for him. Lambert was preparing to return to school to write his end of semester exams when the incident happened at Bronco in the Ifidia Kwabre district of Ashanti region. His body has since been deposited at the Konfanochi Teaching Hospital morgue for autopsy. The Afrancho police has commenced investigations. The family of the deceased is trusting the police to arrest the perpetrator and allow the law to take its course. Residents have also shown their commitment to support the police fish out this suspect. Ibrahim Abubakar, TV3 News, Bronco, Ashanti region.